Really, very really strong result there for Oli on his debut. Um, exceeded your expectations? Yeah, I didn't have a plan before, but uh, as you can imagine, when you ask, uh, to, when I asked Oli to jump into the car on uh, on Sat, on uh, I'm a bit lost now. Friday. Was a Friday? Yeah, it was Friday for the quali. Uh, I didn't expect a so robust weekend that he was. He did very well yesterday, taking it step by step in free practice. Uh, doing a very strong quality because that he missed Q3 for a couple of thousands. And today I was a bit scared also with the procedure, the start, the pit stop and so that he didn't do before. But he was very solid and uh, he didn't do a single mistake into the race. And he was even able to, to speed up at the end when we told him that uh, Norris and, and Hamilton was, uh, were behind him. That it's, yeah, overall it's a fantastic job. and. Uh, can I ask you, because we, we were watching in the commentary box, when he got past Hulkenberg, he only seemed to lose nine seconds on the race compared to Charles. So, you know, that's a, for a driver, never done a full Grand Prix distance uh, under the pressure, and to do his best lap on the last lap of the race, that's very impressive, isn't it? Yeah, the, the good news also is that we have zero day game. <laughs> 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 no, no, that it uh, was amazing on the... On the, on the management, I would say that uh, pace is one thing, but the management of the of the complete event. I don't want just to speak about the race, but from the beginning of the event, he was uh, he was very solid, very robust. He didn't do a mistake, uh, with a good feedback, very calm on the radio, and uh, and so that it's uh, also helping everybody to 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 stay calm. And uh, thanks to him.